Hi, Jim McConnell from Light Elegance in Redmond, Oregon. Today we're going to talk about chemistry and more effect of wavelengths. So kind of a tech talk on physics of wavelengths and their effect on curing pigmented products like gel polishes, pinks, and whites. So we're looking at uh, a lot of the lights right now are 365 nanometers. Um, and some of those uh, LEDs also go up to 405 nanometers. And in those cases, here what we have is a difference of 40 nanometers. Oddly enough, 40 nanometers happens to be about 10% of 405. So given that, what we're going to do is we're going to use this little squiggly line. And this is going to represent a photon as it comes through and cures the product. We're also going to extend that just a little bit, simulating a longer wavelength of material. And if we're curing a gel, and this is the photon coming through at 365, and this is the photon coming through at 405 nanometers, because this is longer, it's elongated by about 10% uh, compared to the 365 nanometer. So because it's been elongated by 10%, because it's 405 nanometers as opposed to 365 nanometers, that additional elongation increases the ability of that photon to penetrate into the gel and giving us a slightly thicker cure where here at 365 nanometers, it's a shorter wavelength, and as a result, it penetrates less deeply into the pigmented system. So conceivably, you would think that if you have two lights with the same output, the same intensity level at different wavelengths, that the slightly longer wavelength would penetrate more deeply into the pigmented system, and in fact, that is the case. If all else remains the same, the 365 nanometer over here penetrates more shallowly than the 405 nanometer. So if you're looking at wavelengths or lights that have a 405 nanometer cure versus only 365, and if all else remains the same, the 405 will cure thicker than the 365. You can change that by increasing the amount of LEDs in the light, which will increase the intensity and will give you a more complete cure and a deeper cure or you can lower those LEDs closer to the fingernails and increase the amount of intensity seen at the fingernail surface, which will also increase its cure thickness. But if all else remains the same, the photo initiators, the resins, and the, the distance that the LEDs are from the fingernails, that you will get a thicker cure with a 405 nanometer. If you have any questions, feel free to write to us or give us a phone call. We're happy to answer those. Again, this is Jim McConnell coming to you from LEHQ in Redmond, Oregon. Thank you very much.